Yes, sir, it goes into the yeah, I saw it. First round win by knockout, near perfect execution. The technique was absolutely gorgeous. Oh, you just push him in the stomach, right? Catch a guy early, maybe you're getting full before he's had a chance to work up a sweat or even get into the fight a little bit. Those strikes can have a bigger effect, and it certainly uh, did here tonight. Now the stats. You know, it's funny, I was actually trying to go for a body. That's why, but somehow you went down. I'm like, what the fuck? How did I? I'm like, how did I hit you in the face, though? It was just like right timing. Uh, one lighter. There you go. Right. You want to use them? If you want, I can change. A day's motherfucker. Yeah, as soon as we go to the ground, you. <laughs> Uh, we'll see. You know, it's fine if you right, if you want to if you want to. Go. UFC lightweight division bout. That's still bullshit. I can't believe I have forty something hours in this. Shit. Good to have you with us tonight from T-Mobile Arena, the home of the NHL's Vegas Golden Knights. And the building in which DC shocked some of the MMA world at UFC 226, but this venue will always have a special place for you. This venue holds a special place in my heart. UFC 226, I became the double champion. This is a fight venue that you should want to compete in. A great arena where you can make history. Tonight, you get your chance. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do. He's going to start looking to land big shots from the top. He needs to move. better move. Yeah, he's got to move, John. He's got to shrimp and try to either get up or pull his opponent back into him so he doesn't have the posture to land that big damage. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Oh, that's a nice strike. Watch the former interim lightweight champ Dustin Poirier in a good striking flow here tonight, DC. That left hand nearly put his opponent out. Nearly puts him out. It can't take many of them. Dustin is so big and physically strong for 155. I can't believe he's to fight at Featherweight. He looks like he could never have made that weight. He's found his home at lightweight, and you see the damage he can inflict with one strike. <laughs> oh, that was a good shit. Watch out on the, the, the grapple for the fucking ground, not like shit. Okay. Shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. Just the way he drew it up here tonight. Saw that little crack of an opening and barge right uh, through pot, A little, a little here. Yeah. I was actually trying to break you down a little more so I could see if I was going to be able to like time it right for the ground opponent. That shit was actually crazy. Eh? I gave both landed it, but I, I still had like my head wasn't fully. I still had like like health on my head. What about you? Then I don't know. That I don't know. Then. 